Yeah, so, so look, we, we, we all have a story. Here's a part of mine. Um, you know, my, my parents, they, they grew up as Christians. However, when I was a kid, they, they weren't going to church, okay? It was, uh, you know, they, they weren't very involved in church. But, you know, God has a funny way of putting the, the people in your life that, that need to be in your life. And uh, I had a group of friends. I, I had uh, five friends, you know, three of them, their, their parents were Sunday school teachers. And the other two were uh, preacher sons. And so there, there was rarely a, a Wednesday or Sunday that I, I wasn't in church, even though I wasn't exposed to it, you know, normally. And every time that, uh, that I, I went to church, it was my choice, right? I made a choice. And anyways, that had such an impact on me that the time I was, I was 15, you know, I, I felt uh, the love, you know, I felt the, the, the love of, of Jesus Christ and, you know, accepted him as my Lord and Savior. You know, at that point, and you know, it was just uh, really incredible that you could make such a transformation in your life that way, and uh, you know, know that God had His hand in it, right? Put the put the people there that uh, that needed to be there. Anyway, <clears throat> so you know, fast forward to college. You know, fast forward to, to college and, and getting married. You know, for for one way or another, we we got away. I got away from church. You know. My wife and I were, were high school sweethearts. She was 16, I was 18. You know, we really never knew each other in the, the church setting, right? We, we knew that, that we both truly believed. You know, she, she grew up Methodist, I grew up Baptist on the uh, opposite quarter, right? We were competing, you know, in, in small town church there, but uh, you know, we, we never really knew each other that way until we, we moved down to Texas, right? We, we had two small kids at the time and really felt like something was missing, you know, and, and we, we didn't know what was missing. But, uh, you know, luckily, through one way or another, we, we got involved here at Good Shepherd. We, we went to uh, a marriage study, you know, back in the day, actually in this, in this gym. You know, that, that really got us back into church and we started connecting on a, on a level that we hadn't connected with in our marriage and it's just incredible that we we each have our our god story and just to to grow together spiritually and it couldn't happen at a better time you know i think uh the way that we we really like to go through life now in in a christ-centered way is we wanted our our kids to have this incredible foundation that you know no matter what happens to them in life that they they know that jesus is there for them and um uh, you know, luckily that, that that's just, again, the way that God works. He, he puts things in your life uh, when you need it, uh, where you need it, right? And, and it's just, uh, it's been incredible to, to grow in that journey. Let's pray. Lord, thank you for the story you've given me to tell. Help me tell it whenever I can and live it out wherever I go. May this story point to your story the story of the greatest gift ever given, the gift you gave us in Jesus. Amen.